All right, guys, now we're gonna remove this hatch panel from the Forerunner. Very, very easy. All you have to do again, panel removal tool right here where the grab strap's at. I always do that on camera. So there's a 10 millimeter in here, which you need your uh, socket for. Then also you want to take out your lights. Go ahead and disconnect them. It's because as you can see, the harness is right there and you wouldn't be able to take it out if the light assembly was still in there. Then you're gonna go ahead and take your 10 millimeter socket wrench right here. And take that out. It's the exact same as the doors. Just try to get a little spot to where you can pop it off and it just starts to come undone. Kind of follow with it just to make sure it doesn't fall on you. And once you make sure that you have all that out, it's resting on the lip up here where the window is. So just go ahead and shimmy it out like so. So make sure again, all your tabs, your white tabs are on this. They go into all these little circles right here. Make sure you didn't cover any circles with uh, anything. And actually, as I'm looking at it, there's a white tab right there. So I need to get that. So I'm just gonna start with the top. Hopefully it slides right on. Oh, that was so easy. Why couldn't all the doors be like that? Make sure you have all your harnesses out. That was so easy. Oh my gosh. That was, thank God. So what I did was just make sure you're good up here. Pop it in. All done. So if that was helpful for you guys, feel free to leave a like, continue down in the playlists, uh, following the whole install if uh, you guys want. If you're new around here, feel free to subscribe and I will catch you on the next one. All right, see you later.